Hello, everyone. Thanks for watching today. Today's topic is mindset takes action. Mindset takes action. Just so just a short one today is about uh, think about your mindset every day. What mindset are you in? Uh, on a scale of one to 10, uh, how are you in your mindset when it comes to your ha just general happiness, your your uh, health, your business, your spiritual, your relationships, where are is your mindset? Because negative brings on negative. If you, if you wake up each day now, please, I'm not, you know, a self-help guru. No one's paying me hundreds of dollars or thousands of dollars to uh, listen <laughs> to me talk like a Tony Robbins or anything, but I've seen them. I've gone to events, I've done things, and I just wanted to help share that, you know, in my uh, life coaching classes that I've taken over the years is that uh, your mindset every day has to be in check to make the a productive day. So put a scale on it. You know, put a scale on it every day because you might say, I'm OK, but you might be saying my happiness today is a five. Well, what can you do to make that a better baby steps can't go five to ten tomorrow or the next day or things that you have to put in place to get to a certain level? Because it is so hard for all of us, especially in today's world, to have a ten of everything. We're completely content with everything in life. It's very hard. So you've got to make sure, because sometimes, especially in real estate, I will say this, and I know I didn't want to go too long today, but um, uh, I've seen it. It's happened in my own life. All of a sudden, you are focused. Your mindset is only on like maybe business, earning, finding buyers, sellers, earning income and doing that. And then you don't even realize you think you're happy with everything else, but you're not especially in real estate where you have to go out all there. I've seen it happen time and time again as people lose connection with family, friends, spouses. I've seen it. I've seen it even happen to me is that it's just because when it comes to you uh, work-life balance, it's hard to draw that line. It's hard to shut off that phone. I'm not saying shut it off because <laughs> I never shut off my phone, but I, I don't take 20 minute phone calls when I'm in the middle of something, I'm doing something else, but I respond, but oh, sorry, get off on tangent there. But is that make sure that you do a mindset uh, uh, every day and uh, just like one to 10 happiness, health, business, just uh, exercise, diet, your whole gamut of life. And if you, you'll realize that you'll always have a checkup, you know, like a checklist in your head or even write it down or journal it so you can make sure you're 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 balancing and juggling all the balls and not letting some of them fall because you could see that. I, I've been through it many times in 30 years. I'll get too busy in work, get too busy, or, I, or all of a sudden just too busy in personal life and then my business goes down, uh, then, uh, you know, things like that. So if you take too much time in personal, I've seen this happen in agents just the last year. And I'm, if you're watching, there's nothing wrong with this. I've had agents right now that are excellent agents, do lots of work, did great the year or two. Then all of a sudden something personal happens, good or bad, you know, because I've had people like become grandparents and then all of a sudden they're watching their grandkids. And all of a sudden I have a talk with them, you know, a yearly follow up. I'm like, hey, you had your business went down 50%. And they didn't even realize it because they got so busy. They're like, wow, I didn't even notice. I mean, I my business went down so much. I've been watching my grandkids that three days a week and I'm doing this and picking them up from school. And it's been great, but they didn't realize their business went up. Then the other way around, you say, you didn't realize that you're missing out on family parties and get togethers because you're working seven days a week and in real estate can do that. So you do that, that check almost daily of, one to 10, where are you at with your mindset and happiness with all the different categories in your life and to make sure you're not missing something and one's falling and one's going up here and there's a balance between all of them. That's the point today. Sorry about the tangents that I always go, go off on. So that's it. Have a wonderful day and uh, hope to see you, uh, most of you very soon and talk to you. And remember, I'm always here for you. Bye-bye.